This video explains how to use the PrepStation software to enter information for Vitec MSDS target slides prior to testing on the Vitec MS instrument. Depending on your laboratory workflow, information can be entered before sample preparation, concurrently with sample preparation, or after sample preparation. At the end of this video, you should be able to Enter information for our target slide for testing on the Vitec MS instrument using the PrepStation software. Required materials A computer with Vitec PrepStation software A monitor A keyboard and mouse A barcode scanner And a Vitec MSDS target slide the Vitec MS PrepStation software is used to link specimen information to Vitec MS target slide spots. The linked information is then transferred via Mila to Vitec MS system. If necessary, log into Windows on the PC by pressing Control Alt Delete on the keyboard. Enter a Windows username and password. On the Windows desktop, double click the Vitec MS PrepStation icon to launch the software. Log into the PrepStation software by entering a Milo username and password with Vitec MS Tech privileges. The sample preparation screen displays by default. General specimen information is entered at the top of the screen. Vitec MS target slide information is entered on the left side of the screen. Scan or type the target slide barcode in the Enter Slide ID field. Only fields that are highlighted in yellow are considered active and will allow data entry. Note, if the PrepStation software was used recently, it may be necessary to click the New Slide ID button before the barcode can be entered. Once entered, the screen changes and displays an image of the target slide. If the slide has never been used for testing, all spots appear as empty circles and are available for testing. If any of the acquisition groups on the slide have been used previously for testing, they will appear grayed out and are considered blocked. No additional testing can be performed in that group. In the Lab ID field, scan the accession number barcode on the culture plate with the barcode reader or enter the number using the keyboard. If necessary, change the isolate number in the isolate field. Verify the correct organism type, bacteria or fungi, is selected. Depending on your PrepStation software deposit mode configuration, single or duplicate, one or two spots will be highlighted for linking to the specimen information. Once all the data is entered, the information must either be validated or canceled. Click the Validate button on the far right side of the screen to accept the information. Alternately, the F4 key on the keyboard can be pressed or the Enter key can be pressed twice to validate the isolate. Once validated, dark blue spots indicate a bacterial sample. Light blue spots indicate a yeast or fungal isolate. To reject the sample information, click the Cancel button or press Shift plus F4. Confirm by clicking Yes. Then re-enter the correct information and validate as above. Use the function buttons to the right of the target slide image to perform any of the following. To erase a spot, select the spot and then click the Erase Spot button or press F6 on the keyboard. Answer OK to the confirmation window. To add an additional spot for the isolate, click the Add Spot button. The software will select the next available spot and highlight it in yellow. To skip a spot on a target slide, select an unused spot and click the Skip Spot button. Skipped spots are highlighted in gray. Spots cannot be intentionally skipped unless the Skip Spot button is used. The software is programmed to fill the slide in order, left to right and top to bottom. Continue adding specimen information for all isolates to be tested on the slide. Once all spots have been prepared and information entered, it is good practice to verify the data entered. Clicking each spot will display the lab ID and isolate number associated with the spot. In addition, verify the correct organism type was selected, either bacteria or fungi, by noting the color of the spot. Information is sent to the Vitec MS by clicking the Send Slide button. Once sent, the slide can be tested on the instrument.
Also note that any information entered incorrectly cannot be changed in the prep station software or in Mila after the send slide button is clicked. For further information on sample preparation, refer to Vitec MS Workflow User Manual Clinical Use US version. Summary Log into Windows on the PC. Log into the prep station software. Scan the target slide barcode. For each isolate to be tested, enter the lab ID, isolate number, and whether the isolate is a bacteria or fungi, then click Validate or press the F4 button. Verify the data for every spot is correct by clicking on each spot to display the lab ID and isolate number. Make sure the organism type is correct by noting the color of the spot. Click the Send Slide button.